What you making? That's hot. That's hot? You making breakfast? Take it out. Mm. Is your oatmeal done? No. It's not done? Not that. Okay. Gang, it's your girl Coco. Your boy Baby Five is actually on the floor playing with his toys, and obviously, I'm in bed, you guys. I wanted to come on here, but before we get started, y'all, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, make sure y'all hit that bell, make sure y'all write down. Y'all, I waited a couple of days into the year to get situated and make sure my mental state was there, and it's there, y'all. But I wanted to come on here and say happy 2024, happy new year, happy everything, you guys. Um, I'm happy to see another year i'm happy for all the blessings and everything that's gonna come this year to me and you guys and we're gonna take down this christmas tree today y'all basically that's what we're gonna do but right now i'm on this show y'all let me tell y'all it's called zatima i love it real bad it's on prime video if y'all have not already watched it tuned in i'm late my sister said but i'm tuning in now i don't know if y'all see my nails but i'm tuning in now y'all so I'll be back after I get into it, and we're going to take that tree down, like I said. All right, Harris gang. So now it's time to take all this stuff down. Five is right here. Y'all can't see him, but we're going to take this stuff down. I'm tired. I'm exhausted. I didn't even want to get out the bed, y'all, because I'm on this show called Fatima, Zatima, y'all. Stop, Five. Hold on, y'all. Stop. Move, no. Start taking this stuff off. I don't even remember how I put some of this stuff on. But yeah, here's gang. I don't know, y'all. School has started, and I'm back just trying to figure it out. Y'all know me. So we're gonna go ahead and put this back in here. We're gonna take the little signs off. It's so many of them. Comment down below if anybody won't like the little signs and stuff. I plan on selling the tree if y'all are interested next year. We didn't even really... I feel like this year I was not even in the Christmas spirit, y'all. I haven't been eating. I'm losing weight. I just don't know how I am and why I am how I am right now. I can't explain it. I wish I could. But I can't. So, we just... I'm just going day by day. I know I've been distant. I'm just trying to figure it out. And school is going to stress me out, y'all. I'm taking an English class and I have a history class. History is honestly my favorite subject. So I know I'm going to ace that. English, I could have sworn I took English. I don't even know how English got back on my roster this year. But I could have sworn I took English last semester. But whatever. So these little things are actually gonna go in the trash cause these came from Dollar Tree. So I don't really think no one will want these. Five wanna help so bad. But yeah, y'all, yeah. Danielle is doing good. She actually started school as well. So yeah, y'all, yeah, we just figuring it out. Five starts back to school tomorrow and yeah. So I actually need a trash bag for this, but let me get one. Is that glitter? Give it here. I'm probably gonna keep these because y'all know I decorate my living room and stuff. And these, no, no, no. Taking off the um the little the sticks, but I'm not 
I'm just ready to get back in bed. It's so cold. Pick it up, bud. It's like 60 degrees out. And I don't know, y'all. Coco is just down. So if y'all feeling like I'm, if it's seeming like I'm down, y'all, I really am down. I can't tell y'all why. It's just a feeling. But every day is not a good day for me. And I'd rather not come on here and, you know, pretend like it is. So I've just been learning to stay to myself a bit. Y'all know the fake pages is back. I just be over a lot of stuff, so. But, overall, we are doing good. Our family is great. I'm back in school, I said that. Five is back in speech. She goes back to speech on Wednesday. Dang, look at the tree already looking plain. Okay. I actually was been supposed to take this tree down, y'all. be a good trip i already started like buying things so uh, i will show you guys that that'll be like a probably like a like a little haul a denver colorado haul so i'm excited about that i wasn't excited because y'all know how i feel about leaving and just daniel not being able to go but it's almost over so Trying to get all this stuff out. Um, so yeah, that's what we're going on the 19th through the 22nd. I'm excited about that. I really needed a trip. I feel like really bad. Um, y'all know we don't us as parents, I feel like we feel bad about saying like we need a break. <laughs> But a lot of people are not able to get the breaks like certain people do. Like, um, I have friends that are, are mothers and they are able to do a lot of the things that I'm not really able to do. Like, they travel a lot more, obviously, because they have, they have significant, they have, their significant other is here or their mom is like younger and the mom is able, you know, like to help with the kids and stuff, even though mama coco do help a lot mama coco is like you know get the ones under the table five mama coco is at that age now where she could only keep an eye on five for a few hours and five y'all know five you running people low so that's what it is i feel like i'm just overwhelmed a little bit with life and get the ones off the floor five so I am happy that I actually get a break. I just hope when I'm out there that I actually can enjoy myself because when I went to um, when I went to Vegas, granted Vegas was lovely. Like I had a great time, but in the back of my mind, I was missing five every five minutes. And this time I just wanna go and I wanna have like a free mind, move back. So, hopefully, I can do that. Okay. 
I'm thinking I'm just gonna be able to put this in a box. I gotta make these things go down. Or up. Hold on. No, this is gonna hurt you. And now five is at that age where he don't play. He gets down. He voices his opinion. If he not feeling something, you're gonna know. <laughs> and my Coco just need a break. That's just what it is. Y'all could judge me. Um, but I know some of y'all gonna feel me with the whole break thing. I need a break. And that's just gonna be what it is. And Dale mom is such a sweetheart. She's actually coming out here so I can actually get that break that I need. So she's coming out here to keep an eye on five so she can help my mom a bit. Um, he's going to be with her, but she's going to leave. And then five will be with Mama Coco for one night. Not even a whole day, just a night. Stop. No. Move back. That's not trying to go in there. So yeah, I don't really know how this is supposed to go. This is my last year, y'all getting a fake tree to stop, pick them up, crazy boy. Cause I need a real tree. This putting these trees up is just crazy. the last piece that has to fit in this box surprisingly everything fitted in this little box I, didn't, I thought i was gonna have a hard time that wasn't hard at all now it's just like i have so much stuff and now it's over it's done the holidays are done it's so crazy how we spent so much money on certain things just for a certain amount of time. But it was worth it. I hope five enjoyed the Grinch. We, we wasn't even really down here a lot of the time, so I really didn't even have to do this. But I'm happy she got to experience that. But yeah, Harris Gang. So let me show y'all. The things I will be giving away, I don't know if I'm going to give them away or sell them, but I definitely am selling the tree. But, like, these and stuff and then the bulbs, if y'all want them, let me know for next year. All right, here's gang. So, I'm back. I'm feeling a lot better today. We going to eat my lunch, and then we going to go pick five up from school. I don't know. I be telling y'all sometimes, y'all know, like, depression and stuff be real. Every now and then, I be going through a little bit, and I be feeling a little ways, and I just don't be wanting to be like that all the time. So, I ordered some tacos. And we finna eat them. And we gonna pick up five. And I'ma tell y'all how I'm doing. I'm trying to figure out where I can pop y'all because the tripod is all the way over there. But as y'all see, I door dashed some Uber Eats. But let me tell y'all about my um I Uber I door dashed some Uber Eats. That sounded crazy as hell. I door dashed some El Unico. Okay. So, and let me tell y'all why this will be my last time using DoorDash. Y'all fell. At least y'all know my cabinets is clean. Um, let me tell y'all <coughs> why this will, that will be my last time ordering anything via DoorDash. Okay, y'all, so I ordered El Unico from DoorDash. I said that already, but I ordered El Unico from DoorDash and the guy was like, the guy was like, Dang. Okay, I ordered. Y'all see my baby in the back. I ordered El Unico from DoorDash or whatever. The dasher was like, "Oh, I can't get in the gate. Could you meet me?" Usually, I press the issue, but I was moving around. I was washing, so I'm like, "Yeah, like you know, like I can meet you." I'm like, "Give me a second, mind y'all. I just told y'all I was washing initially. Initially." Hold on. 
initially, y'all, initially, whatever, initially I said for him to hand me my food. Um, usually I, it's hard to get to my apartment. Like I have to explain it to people, but long story short, he's like, could I meet him? I'm like, yeah, you know what? It's fine. I'll meet you. So literally two minutes past my apartment is all the way, all the way far. Like it's nowhere near the front. So this man had the nerve to text me and say, I'm about to leave. How far are you? This is such a shame. I said, um, if you read the directions in the, the um, memo box, I told you I live all the way far. I don't want to say where. I said, but I'm on my way. And then he wrote again, like, such a pity. I'm like, so I went. I didn't even respond back because I didn't want him to do that to my fool. I got my fool. He was like, what a shame. Don't He said, don't be a bravo, a brava, whatever that means. He's like, um, what a pity. I feel sorry for you. I wrote him and said, I'm reporting you. Because first of all, after you drop my food off, you shouldn't even be trying to contact me. I actually tipped him. So that bothered me because I tried to, you know, be nice because I know this is their job. But what do you mean? What a pity. It's such a bravo. That mean to me, excuse me if this kid's watching, don't be a bitch. Because what the fuck are you even talking about? That pissed me off. I'm never using, I'm never using, um... I'm never using DoorDash again. And then what really freaked me out is he ended up writing back because I said, I'm going to report you. He wrote me back and he said, he wrote me back and he said, what's your address? The store just called me. But I know the store didn't just call you. So why are you asking for my address? I immediately called DoorDash and I made a complaint because if anything happens to me because this guy wants to be a weirdo and he has my phone number and he has my phone number and also my address oh i'm still on doordash but i have to come tell y'all that like they really need to screen these people that they let work here like i was so scared y'all don't even understand yeah i was scared out of my mind but i'm making my food right now so we could talk and we're gonna go pick up Ooh. we're gonna go pick up five once i'm done i love these little vinegar crack carrots but that really did scare me though when he's talking about some what's your address wait what why do you need my address for one for two leave me the hell alone how about that look here y'all um i'm feeling better i'm in a better mood um I think I just need like a little break or whatever. Um, five went to school this morning. The house is clean. Like everything's good. I washed. So I'm like in a better mood. I was able to get a lot done today more than like normal. So I think that's why I feel so relieved. Because usually I be running like a chicken with my head cut off with no time. I feel well rested. I actually took a nap. I haven't been able to take a nap. Y'all know five been on break for a minute now so i haven't really been able to take a nap so yeah let me show y'all food okay that's right we're gonna eat and we gonna leave and get five i'm gonna let y'all eat with me because i haven't hold on y'all Cause I feel like we haven't ate together in a minute. All right. Hold on. All right, y'all. I'm back. Let me turn my burners on because it is closed. We're hmm. gonna drink a Sprite. And I'm gonna talk out of that. But yeah, that stuff with DoorDash was very crazy. It made me very scared. So, 
comment down below if y'all ever experienced anything like that before. This red sauce. Y'all know how I feel about red sauce. Mm. And comment down below if any of y'all ever been to Colorado and comment down some things that y'all think I need to take and all that other stuff. Because this is my first trip of the year with my sister and some of my close friends. And I'm very, very, very excited. So, yeah. I'm going to eat one taco with y'all and then I'm going to get off. But look at that. Mm-hmm. Y'all know I love food. Y'all, this year we're using that mic. The mic will be cracking right now. Okay. Y'all, the mic will be cracking right now if I was using that mic. But I'm going to go ahead and get off here because I don't want to smack y'all be coming for me in the comments. I love y'all Harris gang. I'm in a better mood. Comment down below. We miss y'all Harris gang. If I get a certain amount of comments, I'm going to drop a video every day this week. I love y'all Harris gang. Then y'all love y'all. Most of all, baby, I love y'all. Peace. Oh,